we can't see it. There were no direct obvious symptoms. Her stomach was bothering her, she wouldn't eat. I got a call right back. Jalen needs to be checked in the hospital. There really are no medical treatments. <laughs> Violent behaviors, IQ deficits, problems with ADHD. It causes brain damage. Like, for example, head going through the windshield of a car. It's totally preventable. When it happens, is irreversible, is untreatable. This is a national scandal. And nobody seems to know about it. My children were poisoned when we did home renovation. We hired a contractor. We didn't know that he wasn't using lead safe work practices. He used an open flame torch to remove the exterior paint. The children inhaled the fumes and were instantly poisoned. My children are getting high levels of blood test results. The apartment failed infection. I can't get anybody in the town or state or anybody to get concerned about it. And I feel like my whole world's contaminated. I thought he was okay because I wasn't living in a house that was being sanded. This perfect child, my firstborn son, will just never be the same and there's nothing I can do about it. The children tested positive. Both of them did. I'm quite crying because I don't know if I can help you. <laughs> and I want to be able to help you. My son was, you know, was... This amount of contaminated household dust with lead-based paint will cause childhood lead poisoning. What I'm finding is that it's actually middle and upper income families that are getting poisoned now and that these families aren't being tested. Who's the bad guy here? Definitely the lead industry. Dust from paint had been identified from early on as a major problem. Through lobbying and government corruption, they just keep it quiet. I'm just a volunteer mom whose children were poisoned. I actually started a nonprofit foundation. So we're doing free blood lead testing. We have a health clinic, Excel Health Clinic has donated their time. Whenever citizens get together to organize politically to deal with these issues, they win just about every time. I found a massive violation and I wanted to report it. You're gonna receive an email from a lawyer saying to cease and desist. 